Hi Virgo, how are you doing today? We're going to do a tarot reading, slight past, present and near future. Morning, evening and night, perhaps. So what do Virgans, Virgos <laughs> need to know today? What do Virgos need to know today? What do Virgos need to know today? What do Virgos need to know today? Right, slight past, present and future. So Virgos, we have the Prince of Autumn. Prince of Autumn. So when you're ready <laughs> in your own time, um, you can take action surrounding your future. But really making sure this is the right thing to do and protect your dream, protect your vision and make it happen when you're ready, basically. Um, here in the new uh, present is the six of summer. Six of summer. So for Virgos, you might be feeling a little bit nostalgic, especially surrounding um, brothers and sisters and maybe your own family, your own children. But it's a sense of innocence as well. So maybe this new vision for some of you is starting a family. For some of you, it's looking at how you can create create that vision, create that feeling of innocence to move on. Here in the present, we've got, in the near future, we've got the three of summer. This is all about celebrating who you are on an emotional level. So you may find yourself tapping into old ways, old ways of connecting with new friends, old friends, new friends, all friends. So it's a happy time. That's really good. It's also about celebrating who you are as well as a person. Because when you look at childhood, moving into adulthood, the vision for the future can be quite rich and quite grounded. However, it's the emotional aspect of how you're going to kind of get that dream going. So I'll we'll just have a look at the Moonology to see what's going on there. Emotions are running high. Emotions are running high. So this generally means that when friends are sharing and having a good time, emotions can be high. Haven't seen you for a long time. Oh my goodness, why is that so? You may also find that an old friend will get in contact with you. So this might spark off that start of the day and in the slight past of what am I going to develop more? And for a lot of you, that this aspect of family, childhood will be looked at at a greater level. Now for Virgos who are interested in love, um, I'm going to do, do a little romance card for you because if you're celebrating with friends, some of you might start a new romance. It might be your new vision, new romance in your vision. So what would Virgos, most of our Virgos need to know? What do most of our Virgos need to know? Let's have a look. It's always exciting. Wow. This says free yourself. So whatever that means. So when, when visions of the future are quite slow, and indeed they have to be, it says free yourself. Free yourself from what every emotional aspect in the past is holding people back. So celebrate who you are and celebrate with friends and look back and see how, how you can free yourself. So if you are wanting to start a new romance, this is a great time to really go in depth about 
what you believed as a child in romance not too much fairy tale rubbish <laughs> but more reality of freeing yourself up to celebrate who you are so virgo i wish you the very best today and we'll see you next time lots of love to you all